So as a session drummer, I could do live sessions, I could be a live session drummer, I could be a studio session drummer, and I've done both. I think it's important as a musician and, and growing up playing the drums, I feel like I need a balance of both. When I was younger, it was like, no, I want to tour the world, I want to play in front of lots of people every night, and I want to go see all the places you know that the, the world has to offer. After I did that, I was kind of like, no, I want to be in the studio because I want to go home at the end of the day, and I just kind of want to be in a creative space where I can make music. So I've sort of leaned more heavily in the studio side of things. I grew up in a family of artists, so my dad's a sculptor, my brother's a sculptor, my mom's a photographer. They all have the ability to have physical representations of their work, so they can say, this was the sculpture I made, you know, 1975. My mom has her paintings and photographs all over the wall. I couldn't do that as a live drummer because it's like, well, yeah, I played in that city, kind of blended in with the next city that I played at and then the next city after that. So I found that in order for me to have a legacy to look back on, it was those those studio records, it's the physical representation, whether or not you know it was actually produced as a physical copy, it's something that I can go back and listen to and say, this is how the trajectory of my career went. I started here, I got here, my playing improved, my playing got worse, but that's how I can look back at my career and say, as an artist, this is a representation of, of what I've accomplished. And I, I felt like it was important that my dad, brother, mom were, were artists because I didn't have anything that I could bring to the table. I could just tell stories about you know, playing in Italy or playing in Switzerland. So I leaned heavily on the studio, uh, in studio stuff. And I, I like working with artists. I like being a part of that creative process that they bring. They, they come to me and they say, I have a song, it's really personal to me. And I wanna write something around it. You know, and they bring me into to a to a place that's very personal to them, and I like that.